In this video, I just wanted to share some tips to help you not get snagged when you do happen to cast into a tree or a mangrove or a branch or something like that. Uh, your initial knee-jerk reaction is to try to yank your lure out as hard as possible, and that's actually the opposite of what you want to do because a lot of the times, you know, your hook isn't what's going to even get snagged. Your line will wrap around a branch and then it'll just become snagged that way. And if you go try to yank it out of there, it's not going to come out. So what I recommend doing is if you do happen to make a cast into the trees, you know, just let it hang there and then just slowly drag it out. If you see it uh, swing a little bit, let it stop swinging. And then again, just slowly drag it out. Then when you get close to the end, it'll pop right out. Now to show you something else, when you do make a cast, if you see it going into the trees, just let it go. And the reason behind that is because if you go to cast and you go to stop it really quick, it's going to come back at you and it's gonna wrap around the branches. So again, if you do get snagged, just slowly drag it out of there and it'll come out. Now obviously the next tip is, you know, try to avoid casting into the trees to begin with, but we all do it. Doesn't matter how skilled you are, how advanced you are as an angler, it happens. Lures are attracted to trees. Trees are attracted to lures. So if you do make a cast, it goes too far. <laughs> Just try not to yank it out of there. Just slowly pull it out and that lure should come free because when you go to you know, jerk that lure out, you're either going to wrap that lure around the tree branch even more or you're going to expose your hook and you don't want either of those things to happen. Now another thing to help you avoid casting into the tree and still get an accurate cast is to feather your line on the spool as it's going out. So if you make a long cast see it going towards a tree you want to stop it all I did was hold my thumb on the spool and then just slowly stop that line instead of doing a quick stop where that lure is going to whiplash back it may catch a branch and then you'll be stuck and hung up on the tree so hopefully this tip can help you out if you do happen to get snagged in the mangroves a lot again just slowly take that lure out of the trees you don't want to you know jerk that lure out quickly just slowly pull on it and it'll come out. So if you have any questions about this, please feel free to leave them down below. Also, I'd like to know your feedback. If you have any additional tips you would like to share to help you, you know, get unsnagged if you are fishing trees and mangroves. Now, lastly, definitely be sure to check out our Salt Strong Insider Club where I do on the water reports. As you see right here, I'm on the water. I will show you exactly where I'm at, what I'm catching fish with and how I'm going about catching them depending on the conditions, the weather, tide, time of day, time of year, all those factors come into play. So definitely be sure to check that out. Till next time, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.